بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم continuing to civil 3d classes the today video is uh, requested like same before i make one video for trench uh, that was uh, the whole quantity we compute between the excavation level and the natural ground now one of my friend asked me if we have uh, different prices for different excavation level so how we will divide this excavation level volume how we will we will calculate so i made a just practice uh, plan this is our uh, plan and on the right side of the road and uh, the, the from the station 50 050 there is uh, a five starting and end station is 250 okay if you go to profile the in the profile it's also starting from the uh, 050 to 250 and i put some invert level which we will take as in the excavation level and we will calculate this quantity from uh, 1 meter depth from 2 meter and from uh, the rest what is uh, remaining 1.3 or 1.5 okay first of all you should understand what what data you should have for the five excavation quantity you must have uh, the surface of the ground natural ground and then uh, first uh, is better if you are a surveyor give you the this level the first excavation level Uh, if it is not possible uh, he excavated once time all uh, up to the bed level uh, and then uh, you have to calculate uh, these uh, excavation level in the parts like by depths so there are two method the first one uh, so capping surface i will calculate this bottom surface then i will put here and here and then between these to uh, r3 i will calculate the volume the second one same like this typical section uh, as we uh, yesterday in the previous class uh, 48 video 48 i uh, make an introduction of assembly uh, i will make an assembly like this and i will calculate same like cross section calculate quantity and that volume we will divide by the range is same like surface property so the first one suppose uh, let's suppose our surveyor excavated this uh, area so uh, from the mm, typical uh, section of the pipe uh, you will know what is the width of the uh, trench suppose i will take 4 meter this is 4 meter so uh, offset uh, both side 2 meter here and 2 meter here so this is our uh, area of uh, excavation so the first uh, invert level and this uh, this level will bring by surveyor but uh, as this is the practice video i don't have so i will put this level uh, or suppose uh, from before excavation you want to calculate quantity so you can calculate like this so the here the bed level is 1.7 or you should know with uh, where is the exact uh, level suppose sometime they give invert level so you from the invert level then uh, you will calculate this uh, depth also for, uh, so we will start calculate excavation up to here so now this uh, the elevation from 50 is 1.7 so on the both side of the uh, here i will put uh, from the point i will uh, create point here and uh, from the manual i will uh, put here this uh, asking for the Uh, specify new location so the new location here the two points and uh, then on the 100 uh, there is a random uh, from here they put on the 100 so uh, i uh, i will for two point one here and one here on the 100 and then 150 and then 200 then 250 okay i will now uh, check the elevation uh, so 
for the first one and the first uh, elevation is 1.7 so if you right click on this point and uh, edit point 1.7 is the elevation so put here 1.7 okay and then uh, also this one uh, This elevation is one point. The other one is a one point five four. Already, this uh, elevation will bring survey uh, by surveyor, so you don't need to make this um, uh, because I don't have so. I mean, this is just a uh, video for practice so. 1.54 and 1.37 I will put here and 150 1.37 1.37 okay this one point two one one point zero four so here one point zero four. So now I have excavation level uh, on the both side of my uh, my pipe. So I will create a group, uh, new group. This uh, this I will call this excavation. Uh, anything excavation uh, level. And from here include I will uh, select from the drawing these uh, points one two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. These are the points. And now, uh, if you see the point list, there is the elevation, and the shape is okay. And then I, uh, what will I do? I will uh, create a surface from uh, this uh, group. Uh, this one I have, and I will create new surface, and this I will call the bed bed surface. You must give a proper name so then you will uh, know what surface from volume calculation time you will know exactly where and then uh, I will uh, create a surface from the point group head and the here uh, excavation level okay and there now if you can see uh, this appear here this the surface uh, now uh, we have two surfaces okay so the, the one method we previously uh, in previous uh, video we calculated here we will go here and we will calculate all volume from here you, you can uh, uh, select the base surface and the top surface it will calculate all the surface uh, volume now this will calculate if I will calculate from these two so it will calculate the whole volume but I need only for the first one meter so what will I do uh, for this uh, I will create another surface create surface and then uh, I will write uh, surface dash zero one or from uh, may maybe from one to this uh, uh, the surface minus three like you can write anything uh, so you will know uh, then the surface so this suppose this is surface one surface one is for the uh, one meter um, from the the top it is three meter so you uh, must uh, give us like three meter and click okay okay so now I have um, a surface minus three or minus two you can you can write uh, up to what depth is your surface so uh, for this area this surface I give name surface three okay uh, what will I do I will go to 
surface I will click on surface then uh, on the edit option I will right click paste surface click on the paste surface in this bit surface I will paste inside this surface 3 so now I have uh, here surface 3 also but the same elevation as the bed elevation because I paste the bed elevation uh, surface the bed surface here so the elevation are same now uh, I will select the surface right click and select and when you selected the, the properties of the surface will appear and from the above edit surface option go to raise or lower surface now here the surface 3 is above oh, 1 meter to the bed level so I will raise with a plus value uh, I will give 1 meter and then enter so now this uh, minus 3 surface uh, is above the bed level 1 meter above the bed level if you want to check you can cross check draw a line here right click go to quick profile and click ok and click here now you can see here this is my natural ground surface this is uh, the bed surface can see the name the source here a right and this one minus 3 you can see the source name this is minus 3 this is a natural ground surface NGL okay so now I have a surface a different surface for this uh, depth I will create now another surface for this depth so uh, I what will I do I will right click create surface and this is surface you should give a proper name this is just practice uh, my mess practicing so I give any name mm, surface 2 is for this surface ok so uh, now uh, what will I do I will go to the surface uh, 2 here go to the definition click on the edit option right click and then uh, paste surface option uh, ok if you will uh, paste a bed surface you will move it 2 meter or if you will paste a surface 3 you will move it 1 meter so if I paste bed surface here and then I will select this uh, surface and I will go to select right click here select and from here uh, edit surface uh, I will move it 2 meter because I paste here the uh, bed surface and now uh, okay you can cross check my from the quick profile the quick profile is for that purpose so you can see uh, a quick uh, you can quick review you are what you are doing maybe sometime uh, you did uh, some mistake so you can uh, rectify that uh, mistake okay now you can see one surface uh, this is my bed surface the other surface 3 surface 2 and the rest here and the remaining so uh, as here uh, we have a different prices for the dip, different depth so suppose I, I want to calculate this depth from uh, minus 2 to minus 3 meter this is between two these two surfaces ok so how I will calculate I, I know this uh, this surface is 3 and this surface is 2 the, the base surface is 2 and uh, uh, because this surface first we will excavate up to here then here so this will be the base surface and surface 3 will be the comparison surface as we will come uh, when we will co compute the volume between these two so we will uh, first come up to here then this will be the base surface after that we will ex uh, uh, excavate this area so this surface will be the comparison surface so go to home from the home there is analyze uh, tab and then analyze tab there is volume dashboard ok volume dashboard you can click here there is the option third option create new surface volume volume surface or surface ok this is volume per minus 3 to minus 2 meter uh, remember this is just for practice so I, I writing the, just like this you will know this from your typical section exactly the base surface is 2 
it has passed we will come here then we will go uh, below to this surface so this our base surface if you put uh, 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 like you change the place but you put three above and uh, uh, two below then the cut volume will be in uh, in, instead of cut volume there will uh, it will calculate the pill volume so from here uh, you must put the three the three is compared and click ok now you can see here the cut volume total volume is uh, 802 this is the total so uh, this power volume for what for the minus 3 to minus 2 meter ok uh, uh, suppose uh, minus 3 to minus 2 I will uh, I will show you if you put something wrong if you put the base surface 3 and the comparison surface 2 so what will happen check here it's calculated uh, head 0 2 is a pill because you put the below surface as a compare base surface so it's uh, so will 3d third you will uh, fill here up to uh, the to surface too so if it is coming and fill you must check uh, change the places for the surface and then it will calculate the exact volume okay this is for the minus uh, 3 to minus 2 then again i will calculate from minus 2 to uh, 1 meter minus 1 meter and i will write here volume for here now the base surface will be uh, the one meter uh, I put one meter uh, okay from the two to if I did not give name to here you can uh, you must give the NGL to this between these two it will calculate now volume so the base surface will be uh, two the NGL and the comparison surface will be minus 2 now you can see and it also pasting here the surface between the two uh, the volume surface between the two here so uh, this the uh, how this the metal how you the area the because the width is the same and the length is same so the two the area is the same but the volume is a difference here so uh, like this you can calculate volume and you can paste this volume with your uh, section or uh, here if you want to print your uh, cumulative volume like this and here when you paste here you can see here it's a different uh, they are writing minus three to what you write there uh, it's uh, showing here from minus 2 to minus 1 like angel what will you write it will appear here this cumulative and this separate volume so uh, like this you can calculate a different uh, surfaces volume and uh, hopefully it will help you when you are practicing here or when you are calculating the volume for the trenches the next uh, uh, um, uh, if uh, you we will calculate this by the typical section like we will make assembly and then we will come in the next video i will make a video on this how you will calculate this uh, volume as a what will we do we will calculate this volume from the typical section like this and then we will uh, 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 divide this surface by ranges like we did in the surface properties if i select any surface here suppose this is the volume surface uh, if I select here and I go to the surface properties from the ranges here we, we, we can calculate the depth by depth so hopefully this video will help you uh, okay thank you